Hey guys, this is Abhishek from GadgetStreet.com and today we are here at the Juni event here in Beijing and we have the new device which has been announced today here in China. This is called the Juni E8 which is going to be a flagship phone coming very soon to India. By end of August, you can expect this phone to land in India in 2015. This phone again is pretty good in terms of the overall design. The build quality is also very premium. They have used metal on the edges which does make this phone pretty premium and solid as well in terms of the overall build quality. We have metal buttons over there. We also have a dedicated camera shutter key as well. And on the front, we can see that we have a nice metal key piece over there. And the front camera is also good enough. It can record high definition video. The rear camera is also good. It can also record high definition video. We also have dual tone, uh, two tone LED flash in which it can take better photos in low light as well. And then we have some holes over there and this is actually for the microphone and then we have the 3.5mm audio jack over there on the top in the middle of it and over here we have fingerprint sensor as well on this device so you can unlock the phone using the fingerprint sensor we have Juni branding over there and at the bottom at the back side we can see that we have the loudspeaker mesh the build quality and the overall look and feel of the device is pretty premium they have also added deep touch capacity buttons over there which seems to not have the backlit LED and we will confirm this later because as per the information I have got it looks like the buttons do not have backlit LED again this is going to be a premium flagship phone but the buttons does not have backlit LED and we will confirm that later talking about the LED notification light we do have that the UI which is running on top of Android is the Amigo UI which you can see it is the Amigo 3.1 UI which is the latest version of Amigo UI and you will see this UI to be much more responsive as compared to the Amigo UI which you might have seen on any other Juni phone. Again it does not have application done but it, this UI is going to be very much customized as per the Indian needs. So once E8 comes to India you will see this UI becoming better and more closer to the Indian consumers which is definitely a good thing. The device has great hardware specification which includes a very good processor inside 3 GB of RAM and approximately 64 GB of internal storage and you also get a 32 GB storage model for this phone as well. In all this looks like a very premium phone which is going to come to India very soon. Geoni is dreaming big with this one and this is definitely going to cost approximately 40,000 rupees. As per the Chinese price if we can actually calculate the Chinese price for this device if we calculate directly to Indian pricing is 39,990 which is approximately close to 40,000 rupees. So 40,000 rupees you will have to pay for this one and in this phone you have a pretty good 3020 milliampere hour battery and the back cover is removable. This one has dual SIM card slots so you can two, insert two SIM cards inside and you can also insert a micro SD card into this one. So this is all we have as far as the quick hands-on. Let me just complete this hands-on with the help of a camera test and we will take a photo from this device from the rear camera and we have good light conditions over there. Let me just take a photo of this action figure over there and I can show you this photo right now. This is how it looks like. Again, the photo looks very good, very clear. Colors are very nicely produced. It is almost the original subject which is over there. So the rear camera quality is very good. Let me just take a look over the front camera quality as well before we end this video. And for that, we have to talk to the front camera. So here we have the front camera and as you can see this is how front camera UI look like and let me just take a photo from the front camera as well and for that we have to hold the camera still. So this is a short video which I am right now doing and this video I am doing deliberately because uh, we do not have proper internet connectivity over here and I am not able to upload the actual video which I have done from the camcorder. We will upload that later. but. As of now, this is going to be a short hands-on which I'm going to upload. So I've just taken the photo and I can show you the clarity of the front camera. So the front camera is good as well. It can take pretty good photos in low light and in daylight it can take much better photos. In all, this looks like a very premium device which will be available for a premium price point but Geoni has planned to launch this one to at a very aggressive price point and we will see what aggressive price price point is uh, going to be when they plan to release this device in India. That's all from us. Do let us know if you have any specific question for this device. We would love to help you. You can like this video. This video help you by clicking the like button below. You can subscribe to our YouTube video channel for more videos like this by clicking the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching this video. This is Abhishek signing off. Thank you.